What makes a good story? What I think makes the book a page turner is primarily the characters. You have to really, really care about the people who are in the story. Uh, and what's at stake for them has to be really, really important. How do you decide the narrator's voice? Well, I think that the, the main character is obviously the protagonist, the person who makes it all happen. Um, that voice, I think, is the one that really has to be kind of relatable to the reader. You, you know, you need to sort of say, not necessarily that's me, but you need to be able to see the situation of the story from over the shoulder of, of that narrator, that, that main character. How do you start a story? I sort of set myself the task of making that story as interesting as possible, as quickly as possible. So for me, I find a place that gets you as far into the story as quickly as I possibly can. How do you end a story? I'm a huge planner. I always know the beginning and the ending of a story and at least two or three incidents from the middle. So in a way, when kids talk to me about their writing problem and they're like, how do you end a story? That's the hardest part for me. Uh, I usually know, if not exactly how my story will end, I know the kind of ending that I want. I mean, every story sort of sets up a conflict or a problem and the end has to address that. Now, it doesn't have to address it in a totally predictable way. In fact, it's better if the ending can be unpredictable. Uh, you want those twists, but uh, I certainly know where I'm going when I start a story. So for me, ending is not usually the hardest part. Do you rewrite your stories? One of the things that I like to do in revision is work on my dialogue, because it's really important to me that my characters should talk like real people. Even something as simple as, how does a character say hello? Does he say, hi? Does he say, yo? Or, what's up? Or, how you doing? How are you? Well, if you can get that much personality out of a word, think how much you can get out of dialogue. And I think that, you know, if the FBI says no two fingerprints are alike, characters have dialogue fingerprints. The words they use. Not so much what they say, how they say it. Uh, and revision, rewriting, is a great chance for me to make sure that my dialogue is authentic, that the characters talk like real people.